Welcome to the new by DJSP RC. Today we have the Traxxas uh, Fiesta Rally. I don't have the body on the table right now, I only have the vehicle, and there's a reason for that. I'm doing something special to the body and I can't really show it yet. But what I wanted to do is start to doing my modification to this vehicle here. Um, just to give myself a hedge. If that makes sense. Um, stock out of the box, this vehicle is an awesome vehicle. Uh, it's based off a of slash low CG, if you're not aware. And it is awesome. Seriously, uh, out of the box, it handles well, but I want it to handle a little bit better. There's stuff you can do to it. Um, but one of, the, one of the things I want to do is the stiffening bar from Traxxas, the, the chassis brace, uh, the TRX 6730X. And this is what we have in front here. Now, this kit is made for a couple of vehicles. It does a slash low CG. Uh, it does the normal slash. It does the rustler. And I... It might even do the, um, not the Telluride, the Haas. Not a person sure on that one, don't quote me. But I want to show you guys how to install it on this machine. Uh, it's not hard at all to do. What you'll need is basically a 2.5 mil and a 2 mil. Let's put this aside. And what comes in the kit, you do have your bar two braces and whoop, <laughs> a rear brace. And there is a difference between these two. I'll show you in, in a couple seconds here. And it comes with a sort of screws to replace the one that's in here. Now, one of the first thing we'll need to do is grab our two mil. Now I have on my drill here. You'll need to remove these two right here. You have your motor, you have uh, two bigger ones, like I think they're four mil, and you'll have like a three mil right here. Now these here are pretty loosened for me. I don't want this video to be 10 hours. Now grab these screws, put them aside. Now you're gonna switch your two mil to your 2.5. Now in the back, you have two big screws. In the front, you have two bigger ones here too. We'll remove all four. And don't worry, you don't, even if you mix these front ones, they're all the same length. These four here, put them aside. Now, if you look in your pack, you will have four, is it four or six? Yeah, you'll have six of them, okay? But you'll only have two with thread lock on them, Loctite. The ones with the Loctite, the ones with the Loctite are these guys right here. These two, put them aside. You'll need them in not too long. But these guys here, again, put them close by. Now, in these three, put this guy here for the moment. In these guys here, you're actually going to need this guy here. And these, they are indicated underneath. This one says an R for rustler, and this S for slash. I'm not sure if the camera is gonna pick it up here, but if you look in the corner right here, it says, here you have the R. The rustler one, we won't need. Put that aside. Now I'm gonna grab this one and this guy with our two screws with some Loctite on it. We're going to take our bar, 
depending how you want the track to slash to show on your body, you might decide. I'm going to be a rebel here with Traxxas and put it upside down. You're going to insert it in here. Take one of your screws with thread lock on it and you're going to screw it. Okay, now we take the other end and do the same. And there we go. Now we're going to take our bar, bring the vehicle back. Now there's only one way you can put it in the vehicle itself. It, it's made to fit there. Like some would say, fits like a glove. Actually it does. Now we're going to grab our four longer screw that's left and we're going to go boom, 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 boom. And please don't, do not over tighten them. If you're doing like me, like a drill, know when to stop. These are only screwed in plastic. Yes, there's ways to fix them, but yeah. If you're not sure, do it by hand. Now in your kit, you will have four more screws, two long ones and two short ones. The two short ones go in the front. You will notice right here and here, there's two more screws you can add. Again, these you cannot over tighten them. Or you will strip them, that's a guarantee. Like I said, there's one right here, the other one's the other side. Now the two longer ones are in the back where you're, you remove the, the 2.5s. Now the only down point of doing this bar is let's say you need to do something in the uh, remove the center transmission, you have to remove the bar. But besides that, eh, not too bad. Now what I always do, I do grab myself a small Ziploc, a small Ziploc bag. I take the extra screws put them in the bag and if, if there's any part left of the vehicle I always put everything together because if I ever decide one day to sell this vehicle I'm able to give the stock parts back or if I decide to convert it back to stock this is how you do uh, basically uh, a Traxxas uh, chassis brace and I saw a difference. There's less flex in the chassis going with this bar here. And yeah, if you guys have any questions or comment, post down below. I'll be glad to answer you guys. Uh, and don't forget, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up. I do appreciate it. And hit that uh, subscribe button. That too, I appreciate and does help the channel a lot. Thank you for watching. And there's more to come on this vehicle. Have a great one.